Hi, it's Suzette and welcome back to my channel, Non-Toxic Glitters. So today I wanted to show y'all what I ended up getting from the Whole Foods Beauty Week. Um, they have their beauty bag on Friday the 12th. So I wanted to show y'all all of the value that it came with this year and just all the goodies that were inside. I did do some pictures on my Instagram to show you what I got, but it was like a sneak peek. So I wanted to show y'all what's actually fully in the bag. So if you haven't gotten it yet and you want to be surprised, then of course don't watch this but or fast forward ahead, but this was a really great value and this is my first time purchasing Whole Foods Beauty Bag, but I'm really happy with the value of it. I just can't believe all the products that are inside and I am so excited to share with you what I got. So let me just want to share with you that these bags were designed by Queen Alafia, which is a mission that was that is being talked about and being promoted by Alafia the brand, which I will share with you. They have items in here. It's a clean beauty brand that is sold at Whole Foods, and they are just a lovely brand. Um, they promote like equality and women empowerment, so I really like that. And I do have quite a bit of their items that I use, especially their leave-in conditioner for my hair. So I wanted to share that with y'all that the bags are handmade as well. So this is the first one. And it's this really beautiful purple, like ivory color. And this is the New Essentials. Um, that's like the name of the, ba the bag. And this one is $20, or both $20. And this is worth $135 plus. So, and it kind of gives you a little bit of info, which I will read. So it says, you deserve to indulge in self-care that makes you feel beautiful inside and out. That's why we do the research to find the finest beauty and body care products available. And why we've banned 100 plus ingredients and counting including parabens, phthalates, formaldehyde donors, microbeads, and EDTA. Enjoy this one-of-a-kind curated bag of our favorites for a feel-good beauty boost. So, I am so excited. It's, it's huge too, like as thick as it looks, that's exactly how big it is. So it's not like it's like this not good value or like you're not getting your money's worth, you're absolutely getting your money's worth with just like two or three products. So, all right, I'm gonna dig right in. So upon opening it, you can see, all of the products just fall out. So there's just so many. Let me also turn you a little bit, see if the lighting's better. So, all right, just gonna dig right into the bag, okay? So the first product that I pull out is the Whole Foods Market Single Use Facial Mask. And it says Cotton Cupra Mask Age Defying Acai helps soothe, tone, and firm skin for a more radiant, youthful looking appearance. So that's what it looks like, and yeah, it's just a mask. So I'm excited for that. I love masks, you all know that. So there's that. Next item is the Acure Ultra Hydrating Cream Sheet Mask. Looks like that. And I have used Acure products before. I do love them. I like their shampoo conditioner, I've used it before. So another awesome item. Next item I received in my bag is the Too Chic Clarifying and Calming Deep Conditioning Hair Mask for dry, normal, or hair, oily hair types. Um, it's by the brand Giovanni Eco Chic Hair Care. So I got that. It's a really big, good size, so get a couple uses out of it. I am makeup free. I've been doing a lot of makeup free days lately. I just really like having my skin breathe and I've been using a new um, firming serum so I just want to let my skin kind of breathe and take it in it's just it's really really good and I love how my skin's been looking lately and feeling and I just I like the feeling of bare skin so I know y'all are used to me wearing you know full makeup and kind of talking to y'all about it but I just sometimes I just want to have like bare skin and so these last few days probably the last few weeks I've just been kind of going as makeup free as possible but I'm still, you know, doing my skincare regimen and everything, but I'm testing out a new product and I love it. So let's continue. The Walita, I think that's how you say it, Walita Skin Food. This is the lip butter and this is a 0.27 fluid ounce size. So I already do have this in a full size. I love Walita products. I use their body butter and then their hand food. So that came in the kit or in the beauty bag. Then I have this Derma E. This is the Vitamin C Gentle Daily Cleansing Paste. And it says it's gold, golden turmeric, ancient rice, exfoliates and brightens. And this is dermatolo dermatologist recommended. 
it says it's 100% vegan, soy free, eco ethical, and cruelty free. So, and it's got vitamin C in there too. So I'm excited to try that. And it's quite a bit of product as well. So I see this item when I go to Whole Foods to buy groceries, but I've never, or this brand, but I've never used this brand or done like tested this brand out. So I'm really excited to try this. So this is Dr. Hauschka, Hauschka, I think that's how you say it. I don't know how to say the name of it, but that's what it looks like. And then I, I say it in Spanish, but I don't know if that's how you say it. If it's quince, quince, I say quince, but I, don't, I know there's not a tilde, so I don't know how you pronounce that. Day cream, it says it hydrates and protects. And this is a one fluid ounce size. So let me show y'all what it looks like. One ounce tube, which is crazy, because that's like pretty standard for a normal tubing. So I feel like that's like a full size, which is crazy. And this says that it hydrates and protects each morning after cleansing and toning, apply evening, evenly, excuse me, to face, neck, and decollete with a gentle pressing motion. So I'm really excited to try this. So we'll see what I think of it. The Avalon Organics, this is the Soothing Moisture Cannabis Sativa Seed Oil Shampoo. It says no GMOs, vegan and biodegradable. Oh, it's EWG verified, that's awesome. And then S NSF certified as well, which I need to look up what that means. But I can't believe this is EWG verified. That's awesome. I mean, I can't believe it. That's super cool though. I love when things are EWG certified. So it's kind of like hidden, but it kind of gives you an info card, Whole Foods does, with each product. And it goes into more information about your whole beauty bag. So I think that's pretty awesome. So you can learn about each of your products that you get. So this one next item is i already have I'm very familiar with this product i use it all the time because i have i have this on my in my stash all the time this is the mineral fusion nail polish remover and i've been using this for a while this is i think one of the best nail polish removers i've ever used so it's really really good and it takes off all my nail polish so I am very excited for this item. I'm very excited for everything, but these one, Juice Beauty is extremely expensive, so I know that I'm excited because I use a lot of their samples that I get from like Ulta when I buy things, and every time I use their products, I love them. So this is the Juice Beauty Cleansing Milk, and it's huge as well. This is two fluid ounces, which is amazing. And this is, Juice Beauty of course is a clean brand. I think this brand is Either Gwyneth Paltrow owns it or she is a partner with them, but I'm pretty sure she is the one that talks about this brand all the time. So yeah, it's, it really is amazing. Um, the products are really, really gentle, but they actually work. I've used the exfoliator and I love it. So there's a two ounce size of cleansing milk and another product that I'm very familiar with and have used before and I love it because I love their products is Pacifica. So this is a big old 1.4 ounce facial cleanser. This is the Seafoam Complete Face Wash, which I love. It's very gentle. I've used it. It smells amazing and I love Pacifica products. They're very affordable. It's two items. Never tried this brand either, but I'm excited because I did see them at Whole Foods. Everything I've seen at Whole Foods, of course, but I saw these and I was interested. So this is the Pure Zero Clean Salon Series and this is Clean Color Care Shampoo and Hydrating Shampoo and Conditioner. It says Color Care Therapy Complex. This is what they look like, little babies. They're really not little babies though, because that's a two ounce size, so that's like a really good. All of the products and sizes in these kit and these beauty bags are huge, so I'm really, really excited to try these. Let me smell them. I'm gonna smell one. Mmm, nice and light scent, but I like it. It's like earthy, but I like it. So yeah. Next item I'm extremely curious about, but I am excited for this. So this is a Cure Brightening Vitamin C Jelly Mask. It's like this really beautiful pink color, if you can see it. I'm gonna open it so you can see the shade of it. It's just, it looks like straight jelly. Wow, that smells incredible. You can see like that like jelly, pink jelly, it's beautiful. So I'm excited to use that, the jelly mask and it's by Acure. And this is a 0.25 ounce, so a quarter of a fluid ounce. I've never used this brand. 
This is Evan Healy, I think that's how you pronounce it. This is the Blue Cactus Cooling Balm. It says it's a soothing and velvety balm to calm and moisturize sensitive, dry, and devitalized skin. Looks like that. And it's this blue, really pretty blue color. And it says apply directly to face and neck, still damp from misting of hydrosol. Press in or massage gently, ideal for face, eyes, lips, or anywhere on the body. Allow to absorb before applying makeup. So I'm really excited to try this. I've never used any of Evan Healy products. Getting down to the last three for this bag. So we have, and I was telling you all about, this is a Lafia. This is the Everyday Coconut Virgin Coconut Oil. This is the Vegan Lip Balm. I cannot wait to use this. I know it's going to be amazing. Everything I use from a Lafia is amazing. I have their Lavender Shave Cream and I love it. I have their, it's like their curly hairline and their leave-in conditioner and I love it. And then I just bought some of their deodorant, so I'm really excited to try it. So this is the Lip Balm. Can't wait. And the last two items I'm really excited for. So this is, I think it's pronounced My Shell or Michelle Dermaceuticals. This is the serums and oils. It's a remarkable retinol serum, concentrated, vit concentrated vitamin A, and this is anti-aging. I've never used anything by this brand, but I know a lot of her, a lot of their products are um, EWG verified. So I'm really, really excited to try this. So it's a little guy. This is 0.17 ounces, but still really good value to try. And then the last item that I have in this beauty bag that I've never used either is a brand called Mad Hippie. The packaging is so gorgeous and beautiful. I love how it looks. There's a lot in this one. This one's got, oh, it's half an ounce. Yeah, it's half an ounce. This is the vitamin A serum. This beautiful dropper style. And it's got HPR, which I don't know what that means, and sodium hyaluronate. Hyaluronate, yeah. So, and I just, like I said, I think the packaging is so beautiful. I've seen other Mad Hippie products. So yeah, so there's that bag. So we have completed the new essentials bag and I'm gonna turn you. Here it is. And this is Glow Up Beautiful. So big old bag. So let's start with this one. So upon initial opening, and I have opened some of these products. Again, just pouring everywhere, there's so much. So let's just, I'm just gonna dig right in. So the first item, and I did crack it open, but I haven't used it, is the Alba Botanica Acne Dope, Dope, yeah, Acne Dope Pimple Patches, looks like this. And it says clear adhesive dots target pesky pimples, and you get 40 single use hydrocolloid patches. Really, really cool. And then you just open them up here, and then just to show you, so cute. This is how they look, they're really, really cute. And these are, it says plant-based and cruelty-free. So I'm excited for that. This is the Sheer Hydration Daily Cream. This is a 0.23 ounce size. And crack it open. Cute little tube. I love how these are all, tri a lot of these are like travel size and smaller size so I can just take them with me on the go and have them at work and for traveling, which I love. I'm not new to this product or this brand. Um, I've used this before and absolutely love it. This is the Shea Moisture Head to Toe Nourishing Hydration 100% Extra Virgin Coconut Oil. Looks like that. Big old jar. This is a 3.2 fluid ounce size, so huge. And I love using this for pretty much everything. My hair, my nails, I mean, everything, face, to remove makeup, whatever you want, so. This is the Juice Cleanse Super Greens and Adaptogens Shampoo and Conditioner, which has ashwagandha, spirulina, kale, and spinach. It says it's energizing shampoo and conditioner for stress hair shampooing. So, really, really cute. And then these are one fluid ounce sizes each. Lafia, this is the same one that I got in the other bag. This is the Everyday Coconut Virgin Coconut Oil. This is a vegan lip balm. So each bag does come with that. The purple bag had vitamin A serum, and this one's got vitamin C serum by Mad Hippie. So this is with con conjac or con not cognac con conjac root, fur furulic and hyaluronic acid. So it looks like if you can see, really really cute and quite a bit. It's half an ounce, which is a lot. So.
Medicine by Evan Healy. This is a different product. This is the Rose Vetiver Harmonizing Balm. It says a silky and dewy balm to balance and revitalize dry and combination skin. So cool. It's for a different use. So I'm excited. Okay, Andalou Naturals. I used to use their hairspray and I loved it. This is the Rejuvenating Cream. It's plant-based retinol alternative. It's new with, I do not know how to say this word, Bacuchial, Bacuchial. It's like a retinol derivative. So this is what it looks like. And this is a 0.4 ounce size, so good value. I have never used any of these products yet and I've heard really good things. So this is Coco Kind. This is the resurfacing sleep mask. It says it's an overnight mask with plant-derived retinol alternative. So that's what it looks like. This is a 0.5 ounce size. I don't know why I skipped the mask, but I'll show them to y'all. So I don't know if this is the same or not, but this is the Cotton Cooper mask. Yeah, I think it is. It's a soothing avocado and it's by Whole Foods. I think it's the same mask. The little kit of, you know, all your goodies. This is different. So this is the Yes to Avocado Fragrance-Free Hydrating Cream Mask. And this is good for dry skin. It's got 98% natural ingredients. Cute. Old one. So this is the Seaweed Bath Company Detox Repairing Hair Mask. And this is with apple cider vinegar and aloe. It's nutrient-rich seaweed, purifying French clay, and moisturizing coconut oil. And it's supposed to awaken with rosemary and mint. It's a big, big size too. It's one and a half fluid ounces. So it's a lot of hair mask. This is awesome because this is a great value and I've used Trilogy before. I've used their facial cream and it's a good brand that I can purchase from Credo. So this is Trilogy. It's rosehip oil antioxidant plus certified organic rose peen for brightening and skin tone elasticity and firmness, fine lines and wrinkles powerfully natural and it's certified organic. So it looks like this, that's how they have a little case. And then when I open it up, it gives you all these, this information about it. And then there's the little, the little guy. And this is a 0.17 fluid ounce size. So next item again is another repeat of the other bag. This is the Sea Foam Complete Face Wash by Pacifica. And a new item, this is by Ren Pure. It says plant-based beauty. This is the apple cider vinegar, plant-based performance ingredients, clarify and shine scalp serum. It's zero gluten dyes, propylene glycol, sulfates, parabens, phthalates, and formaldehyde. And it says after shampooing, apply a small amount directly to the scalp, massage through the ends, and then rinse. So that's gonna be awesome. I'm excited to try that for my hair is not a repeat it is a variation but it's also another juice beauty product so i'm really excited about that this is a two fluid ounce size of the blemish clearing cleanser so another great value juice beauty product this is the blemish clearing cleanser and this is the cleansing milk so i'm excited to try that and that is it that's it for my whole foods beauty bag 2021 haul both bags i had so much stuff i'm so excited to use these products and let you know what I think about them. And I'll probably do some Instagram stories for y'all. Let me know if y'all ended up getting which bag or both bags like me because you love trying new stuff. And I hope y'all enjoy my little haul and I will see y'all very soon. Bye.